What's up everyone, we're back with another video. Today, we're diving deep into the world of cybersecurity with a look at the top 10 Android hacking tools that every aspiring or seasoned ethical hacker should have in their arsenal for 2024. We're talking about the software that professionals use to test the security of Android applications and devices, find vulnerabilities, and ultimately help make the digital world a safer place. Whether you're just starting out or you're a seasoned pro, this video is your one-stop shop for the most essential tools to up your cybersecurity game. From reverse engineering apps to analyzing network traffic and everything in between, we'll break down each tool, what makes it unique, and why it deserves a spot on this list. So buckle up, grab your favorite beverage, and let's get started. First up, we're kicking things off with APK Studio a powerful yet user-friendly tool designed for reverse engineering and modifying Android applications. Now, if you're new to the game, reverse engineering is basically like taking apart an engine to understand how it works. With APK Studio, you can decompile APK files, which are the installation packages for Android apps. Think of it like unpacking a compressed file but for apps. This gives you access to the app's source code, resources, and other components, allowing you to analyze its inner workings. But APK Studio isn't just about looking under the hood. It also lets you modify existing apps or even create your own from scratch. Want to change the app's layout, tweak its functionality, or even translate it into another language? APK Studio has got you covered. One of the things that makes APK Studio so great is its user-friendly interface. Even if you're not a coding wizard, you can easily navigate through the app's features and start exploring. And if you ever get stuck, there's a vibrant community of developers and security researchers ready to help you out. But APK Studio's true power lies in its versatility. Security professionals use it for vulnerability assessments, penetration testing, and malware analysis. Developers can use it for debugging, modding, and understanding how other apps are built. So, whether you're looking to enhance your security skills or just want to tinker with your favorite Android apps, APK Studio is definitely worth checking out. Next up, we have Drozer, a powerful security testing framework specifically designed for Android. Now, while APK Studio is great for dissecting individual apps, Drozer takes a more holistic approach, allowing you to assess the security posture of an entire Android system. Think of Drozer as your go-to tool for identifying vulnerabilities and potential data leakage points in Android apps and devices. It lets you perform a wide range of security assessments from basic penetration tests to advanced attacks, all from the convenience of your command line. One of the things that sets Drozer apart is its modular design. It comes with a core set of modules for common security testing tasks, but you can also extend its functionality with community-developed modules or even create your own. This modularity makes Drozer incredibly versatile, allowing you to customize it to your specific needs and target specific areas of an Android system. Whether you're interested in testing for insecure data storage, analyzing network communication, or exploiting vulnerabilities, Drozer has got a module for that. But Drozer's power doesn't stop there. It also boasts a powerful scripting engine that lets you automate complex attack scenarios. This means you can create reusable scripts to test for common vulnerabilities or even simulate real-world attack chains. And just like APK Studio, Drozer benefits from a strong community of security researchers and developers who contribute to its development, share modules, and provide support. So if you're serious about Android security and want a tool that can grow with your skills, Drozer is definitely worth adding to your toolkit. Now let's shift gears a bit and talk about Exposed Framework, a tool that's all about pushing the boundaries of what's possible with Android customization and modification. Imagine having the power to tweak and fine-tune every aspect of your Android device, from the system level all the way to individual apps. That's what Exposed Framework brings to the table. At its core, Exposed is a framework that allows you to install modules on your Android device that can modify its behavior. Think of modules as add-ons or extensions that unlock new features, enhance existing ones, or even bypass system limitations. But Exposed is not just about tweaking system settings or adding cosmetic changes. It's a powerful tool for security researchers and developers to test and exploit vulnerabilities. By creating custom modules, you can simulate different attack scenarios, analyze app behavior in depth, and even develop exploits for known vulnerabilities. 
For example, you could create a module that intercepts network traffic from a specific app, allowing you to analyze its communication patterns and potentially uncover sensitive data being transmitted. Or you could develop a module that bypasses root detection mechanisms, giving you deeper access to the system for testing purposes. The beauty of Exposed lies in its open source nature and the vibrant community surrounding it. There's a vast repository of modules developed by the community, covering a wide range of functionalities. Whether you're looking to improve your device's performance, enhance its security, or simply experiment with new features, chances are there's an Exposed module for that. However, it's important to note that Exposed requires root access to your device, which means you'll need to have an unlocked bootloader and a custom recovery installed. So, if you're comfortable with the risks and want to unlock the full potential of your Android device, Exposed Framework is definitely worth exploring. Chapter 4. Burp Suite, the Swiss Army Knife of Web App Testing Now, no discussion about hacking tools would be complete without mentioning Burp Suite, a heavyweight champion in the world of web application security testing. And while it's not strictly an Android-specific tool, its versatility and power make it an essential asset for anyone serious about mobile security. Think of Burp Suite as your one-stop shop for everything web app security. It's a suite of tools designed to intercept, analyze, and manipulate web traffic, allowing you to uncover vulnerabilities and test the security of web applications, including those running on Android devices. At the heart of Burp Suite lies its proxy, which acts as a man in the middle between your browser and the web server. This allows Burp to intercept all HTTP and HTTPS traffic, giving you full visibility into what's being sent and received. But Burp Suite is much more than just a proxy. It comes loaded with a comprehensive set of tools, including a scanner for automatically detecting vulnerabilities, a repeater for manually modifying and resending requests, an intruder for performing automated attacks, and much more. One of Burp Suite's key strengths is its extensibility. It comes with a powerful API that allows you to create custom extensions, add new features, and integrate it with other tools. This makes Burp Suite incredibly versatile, allowing you to tailor it to your specific needs and workflows. And if you're new to Burp Suite, don't worry. There's a free community edition that provides a great starting point for learning the ropes. And as your skills and needs grow, you can upgrade to the professional edition to unlock its full potential. So whether you're testing mobile web apps, APIs, or traditional web applications, Burp Suite is an indispensable tool for any security professional. Chapter 5. ADB, your direct line to the Android Command Center. Next up, we have a tool that's as fundamental to Android development as it is to security testing, Android Debug Bridge, more affectionately known as ADB. This command line tool is your direct line of communication with your Android device or emulator, giving you access to a treasure trove of information and control over its inner workings. Think of ADB as a universal translator between your computer and your Android device. It allows you to send commands, transfer files, install and uninstall apps, access the device's shell, and much more, all from the comfort of your terminal. For developers, ADB is an indispensable tool for debugging apps, pushing updates, and monitoring device performance. But for security researchers, ADB unlocks a whole new level of control and access, allowing you to dig deeper into the system, analyze its security posture, and even exploit vulnerabilities. One of the most common uses of ADB in security testing is accessing the device's shell. This gives you root-level access to the file system, allowing you to browse directories, view files, modify permissions, and execute commands as if you were logged in as the super user. But ADB's capabilities go far beyond just file system access. You can use it to install and uninstall apps, even those that are not available on the Play Store. This is particularly useful for testing security-related apps or analyzing potentially malicious applications in a safe environment. You can also use ADB to monitor device logs in real time, giving you valuable insights into app behavior, system events, and potential security issues. This is particularly useful for debugging apps, identifying vulnerabilities, and analyzing malware behavior. And if you're working with Android emulators, ADB becomes even more powerful, allowing you to create, configure, and manage virtual devices with ease. This is especially useful for testing apps on different Android versions, screen sizes, and hardware configurations. 
Whether you're a developer, a security researcher, or simply an Android enthusiast, ADB is an essential tool that you should definitely have in your arsenal. Chapter 6, Frida, Injecting Code and Unmasking Android Secrets. Now let's dive into the world of dynamic instrumentation with Frida, a powerful toolkit that lets you inject your own code into running Android apps. Imagine being able to intercept function calls, modify app behavior on the fly, and extract data directly from memory, all in real time. That's the kind of power Frida brings to the table. At its core, Frida is a dynamic instrumentation framework that lets you inject JavaScript code into native apps on various platforms, including Android. This means you can interact with an app's internal workings while it's running, giving you unprecedented control and visibility into its behavior. For security researchers, Frida is like having X-ray vision into the inner workings of an Android app. You can use it to bypass security checks, hook into sensitive functions, manipulate data flows, and even develop exploits for vulnerabilities you discover. One of Frida's key strengths is its cross-platform support. You can use it to instrument apps on Android, iOS, Windows, macOS, and Linux, making it an incredibly versatile tool for security testing and reverse engineering. Another thing that makes Frida so powerful is its scripting capabilities. You can write JavaScript code to interact with the target app, define custom functions, and automate complex tasks. This makes Frida incredibly flexible, allowing you to tailor it to your specific needs and workflows. And if you're new to Frida, don't worry. There's extensive documentation and a vibrant community of users and developers ready to help you get started. So if you're serious about mobile security and want a tool that lets you peel back the layers of an Android app, Frida is definitely worth checking out. Chapter 7. AndroGuard, your Android reverse engineering companion. Let's talk about AndroGuard, a powerful open source toolkit designed specifically for reverse engineering Android applications. If you're serious about understanding how Android apps work, identifying vulnerabilities, or even developing your own security tools, AndroGuard is an essential companion in your journey. Think of AndroGuard as a Swiss army knife for Android reverse engineering. It provides a comprehensive set of tools and functionalities, allowing you to decompile APK files, analyze their code, and understand their inner workings. One of AndroGuard's key strengths is its ability to decompile Android apps into various formats. You can choose to decompile the app's code into Smalley, a human-readable assembly language for Android, or even into Java, the original programming language used to develop most Android apps. But AndroGuard doesn't stop there. It also provides powerful analysis tools that allow you to identify potential security vulnerabilities, understand the app's structure, and even visualize its control flow graphs. For example, AndroGuard can help you identify potential security issues like insecure data storage, improper use of cryptography, or even the presence of malicious code. It can also help you understand how the app interacts with other components of the Android system, such as the network, the file system, or other apps. And if you're developing your own security tools, AndroGuard provides a Python API that you can use to automate tasks, integrate its functionalities into your own scripts, or even create custom analysis modules. Whether you're a security researcher, a mobile developer, or simply an Android enthusiast who's curious about what's happening under the hood of your favorite apps, AndroGuard is a valuable tool that can help you unlock the secrets of the Android ecosystem. Next up, we have Quark, a powerful engine designed specifically for analyzing Android applications for security vulnerabilities. If you're tasked with assessing the security of Android apps, whether you're a developer, a security researcher, or a pen tester, Quark can be your secret weapon in uncovering those hidden flaws. Think of Quark as a sophisticated code detective that meticulously examines every nook and cranny of an Android application looking for potential security weaknesses. It combines static and dynamic analysis techniques to provide a comprehensive view of the app's security posture. On the static analysis front, Quark dissects the app's code without actually running it, looking for patterns and vulnerabilities that are often missed by manual inspection. It can identify issues like insecure data storage, improper use of cryptography, code injection vulnerabilities, and much more. But Quark doesn't stop there. It also employs dynamic analysis, which involves running the app in a controlled environment and observing its behavior. 
This allows Quark to uncover vulnerabilities that only manifest themselves during runtime, such as memory corruption issues, logic flaws, or insecure network communications. One of Quark's standout features is its ability to generate detailed reports that highlight the identified vulnerabilities, their potential impact, and recommendations for remediation. This makes it easy for developers to understand the security implications of their code and prioritize fixes. And if you're a security researcher or a pen tester, Quark can help you quickly identify potential attack vectors, develop exploits, and demonstrate the impact of vulnerabilities to clients. Whether you're part of a development team, a security professional, or simply someone who cares about the security of Android apps, Quark is an invaluable tool that can help you build, test, and deploy more secure mobile applications. Let's talk about Android Tamer, a comprehensive penetration testing platform that's purpose-built for assessing the security of Android apps and devices. If you're serious about uncovering vulnerabilities and securing the Android ecosystem, Android Tamer is your ultimate playground for all things penetration testing. Think of Android Tamer as a virtual lab specifically designed for ethical hacking and security assessments of Android systems. It provides a safe and controlled environment where you can unleash a wide range of tools and techniques to identify and exploit vulnerabilities. One of Android Tamer's key strengths is its all-in-one approach. It comes pre-loaded with a vast arsenal of tools, from vulnerability scanners and exploit frameworks to reverse engineering utilities and forensic analysis tools. Whether you need to perform reconnaissance on a target app, analyze its network traffic, decompile its code, or develop custom exploits, Android Tamer has got you covered. It's like having a Swiss army knife of Android security tools, all neatly packaged in a user-friendly platform. But Android Tamer is much more than just a collection of tools. It provides a structured methodology for conducting penetration tests, guiding you through the different phases of the assessment process. From information gathering and vulnerability analysis to exploitation and post-exploitation, Android Tamer helps you approach penetration testing in a systematic and efficient way. And if you're new to penetration testing, Android Tamer provides a wealth of resources, including tutorials, documentation, and even pre-configured virtual machines to help you get up to speed quickly. Whether you're a seasoned penetration tester or just starting your journey into the world of ethical hacking, Android Tamer is an invaluable platform that can take your skills to the next level. And there you have it, our top 10 Android hacking tools for 2024. From reverse engineering apps to analyzing network traffic and everything in between, these tools are essential for anyone looking to dive deep into the world of cybersecurity. Remember, the key to mastering these tools is continuous learning and practice. So don't be afraid to get your hands dirty, experiment, and explore the vast resources available online. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more cybersecurity content, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on future videos. And be sure to share this video with your fellow tech enthusiasts and aspiring hackers. Until next time, stay curious, stay safe, and keep hacking.